Good morning. Still in the same spot. Um, or I should say back in the same spot because I've been in Santa Paula uh, all day yesterday. Did some work, um, had some food and uh, the coming days are a bit more work and stuff because uh, I've got to send over quite some uh, work to do and um, so I don't know what exactly the coming days will be and look like um, what I can and cannot film uh, Mike was here last night too but he had to carry on uh, early already um, I probably see him in one of the days to come again but um, yeah um, like I said the coming days will probably be more work related and um, stuff like that yeah that's also part of uh, van life uh, the fuel tanks gotta be filled and there uh, has to be food on the table so um, it's also part of um, a digital nomad as uh, working on the road let's say like that um, so yeah I, I don't know what the day will bring and um, but I'll keep you posted like always before we drive on to Santa Paula <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> just gotta get in the water. Ah, she's wet, and then you can just drive over to Santa Paula and then uh, she can lay down on the towers and uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> She loves the water. On our way to uh, Santa Paula again. Oh, it just was in the sea, so she uh, and enjoyed herself again. She's soaking wet. We tried to um, dry her off a bit with a towel, but she was in my seat before first before I could get the towel so that was bad so now I'm sitting on her sheepskin and just gotta remember to put that bag in the, in the back or put it on the steering wheel or something that the seat can dry out properly and uh, yeah but we are now on the way to Santa Paula uh, the same place at the harbor getting some use of their reasonably fast Wi-Fi so I could uh, upload uh, some videos for you guys and I've got uh, some work to do so we won't get bored today and then uh, probably for the night we're gonna drive a bit further south but uh, I don't know how and where and where exactly it depends a bit on how the work goes so um, yeah. That's one thing you don't see every day. A rally edition, homemade I guess, of a Fiat Panda, a four-wheel drive. Look at that, amazing. <laughs> I love those kind of things. Wherever she can enter the water. <laughs> Doesn't have to be the beach. It can just be a little corner in the harbor. <laughs> Wherever. <laughs> yeah, Yankee. I like the smell of the fishing nets. <laughs> they just rolled them out. 
they're also repairing or rolling out. I think they are repairing those fish nets. Uh, we are on the fisher har fishing harbor, and um, yeah, the boats just come in, and uh, there are also like a, a little marketplace down there where they sell the freshly caught fish. I might walk over there, show you guys. Bo, take the ball. Yeah, go. Trying with the sun, but we're at the edge of the fishing harbor now. All the boats, a lot of boats back in. This one, the small ones, and right to the back there, there are the big ones. I also understood that Santa Paula is one of the biggest active fishing harbors in this region. So, try and see if the markets are open already. They're not all open yet, but a few are. So they are selling the fish they caught today. Nice like this. So you always can get fresh fish if you're in the neighborhood. There's also a sun clock here in the harbor and it's um, two sides. It, it has three sides. Two sides are especially uh, orientated to Santa Paula. So with the uh, Longitude and latitude. It's also got date lines. Don't know how that works exactly, but this is what you normally, or normally, mostly see on sun clocks. But yeah, ice. We did walk by this tree a few times. I hope you can hear it on the video. But it's full of birds. I don't know the English name for them, they're yeah, from smaller to bigger ones. <laughs> and uh, you can also see on the sidewalk here, yeah, it's full of bird shit. <laughs> but that's their, 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 the place where they sleep, I guess. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> Amazing. They've been out, I guess downtown or something <laughs> and now for the evening they return and all find a place to sleep in this uh, yeah there are sparrows and and small stuff there's a group and then they, they come over land in this tree amazing just leaving uh, Flow links of uh, we're working there and, um, yeah, the biggest part of the day. Had um, a lot done, I must say. Um, set uh, at my uh, favorite spot in the harbor. The had some food, had some drinks. Did a lot of work. Did some uh, uploading YouTube videos for you guys. And um, I'm following Mike now. He has been a bit more south uh, the last few days for uh, some stuff and uh, yeah but this evening we had coffee together and now uh, we're driving back to the coastal road so uh, yeah let's see if there is a uh, spot is still uh, free but uh, there are a lot of spots down there so and not we can easily find another one it Think, or it might be very busy due to it being the weekend now it's Friday evening so I will we'll see I uh, I imagine it uh, won't be a problem <laughs> 